Mel from Bailey Property Management and we're here today at one of our city fringe units. We're just going to take you in and quickly show you what it is we look at in a bathroom when we're doing a routine inspection. Follow me. So here we are in the bathroom at our city fringe unit. As with most units, the laundry is also incorporated into this space. So here basically we just look at the stainless steel trough, just needs a quick wipe down to remove any watermarks and same with the drain plug, empty that of any hair or build up that might be in there. Bench spaces, as long as these are all wiped down and clean, there's really nothing to be worried about. Vanity basins. Biggest thing with a vanity basin is ensure you take the plug out, which a lot of these will just screw off, and make sure that you keep clean inside because there can generally be a lot of build up from soap scum, um, which will stop with the draining of the water. Uh, bathtubs, very basic. A lot of us don't usually use our bathtubs anyway, but it's very important to just keep them wiped down and clean. And again, with the plug hole, making sure that's free of any hair and any grime or soap scum build up. Taps, just wiped down. So it's really not that difficult on this side of the bathroom. Okay, so on this side of the bathroom, I've actually taken down now your exhaust fan cover. It's really important to keep these free of dust and any sort of grime build up. Um, otherwise it will slow the functionality of your fan. It will not uh, take as much air away and steam while you're having a shower and therefore this will encourage the growth of any sort of mold or mildew, which is definitely something we don't want. Very easy, take it down, give it a quick wipe over, soak it even in the bathtub, done. Clips back up on top, no dramas at all. Shower screens, also so much easier if you just do this with a squeegee as soon as you get out of the shower. Once you've done that or everyone's finished, give it a quick spray over, wipe down with the squeegee, glass will stay crystal clear and lovely. Shower screen door racks as well. Really important to clean along the frame here as these also get a lot of calcification and build up. Really important to keep that clean. Easily done straight after you've had a shower, at least once a week even, just make sure you wipe that down. Shower heads are the same. Like you'll notice that sometimes they can get a little bit green, which is calcification. Just wipe these down so again, there's no build up. So the key here is making sure you're keeping things clean straight after you've used them to Avoid any build up on any of the um, taps or shower screens within the bathroom. Toilets, this one's hidden a little bit over here. Generally, in toilets, though, we would just look at obviously the toilet seat, make sure that's all wiped down and clean. More importantly, though, the floor space behind the toilet, which is where most people forget there can be a lot of fluff and build up behind the toilet. So just make sure you wipe that down every now and then and the top of the system. And bathrooms are easy before a routine inspection. Thanks for watching.